What we've been told is that two missiles hit this building. You can see all the rubble around me here. It's, we're told it was hit perhaps a couple of hours ago and that when the missiles came in, at least one of them smashed through the roof of the building and then the second one, we're told, crashed through the roof and then it waited until it got right into the basement of the building, the rubble, the basement of the building before it exploded. That's, that's what we're being told happened in this particular building and the rubble is strewn all over the ground outside of here. And it's not just the one building that seems to have been damaged here. Coming down the steps from where we were inside there, outside, over here, I pick my way around this broken fence here. Over here, I don't know if you can see past the soldier here, but the, you can see the large, here we go, the large pieces of reinforced concrete, steel reinforced concrete of the building. And up there you get an idea of where there's a hole there. It appears as if one of the missiles has gone through. But there are quite literally huge chunks of rubble on the ground here. And it's strewn all across this area over here where the journalists like us have been brought in to take a look at it. And this is all in the compound, the same compound that's used by Colonel Muammar Gaddafi. We are in Bab al-Azizia. That's the leadership uh, headquarter uh, in which the leader lives and works with hundreds of families uh, of the soldiers and the security forces and the civilians who work here. Also we have hundreds of civilians as you can see who came here two days ago in support of the leader and to protect the compound and what happened is that two hours ago a rocket hit uh, this particular building destroying it. Uh, fortunately no one was seriously harmed uh, what the uh, spokesman for the Pentagon said earlier, that they will not target the leader. It's not really a very honest statement. You, you think they are targeting Muammar Gaddafi? Well, you judge it, because why is this rocket here? This is a very famous location. They cannot have mistaken it for anything else. The Americans attacked this very location in 1986, when they tried to assassinate the leader and they failed. And they killed his daughter. So this is for us, this brings back memories, Nick, and they are not nice memories. And we believe they are trying to terrorize people, they're trying to weaken our spirits. So impossible for us to know exactly what happened here or what indeed this building was being used for, but certainly a lot of anger and a lot of frustration here in Tripoli tonight. Nick Robertson, CNN, Tripoli, Libya.